welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to connect a godaddy email to a wix website let's begin now the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials click on it if this is your first time here in wix you might want to click on the sign up button and it's very straightforward and easy because you need to just click on the continue with Facebook or you can simply continue with your Google. And once you click on the sign up button, you're all set. Then after that, we need to sign into our GoDaddy account. Click on sign in. Because we need all this information ready. If you don't have an account yet, you might want to click on this option right here. It's very straightforward and easy because you can continue with their Facebook, Google, or your business or work email. And once you've done that, you are all set for both platforms. Now, to connect a GoDaddy email to a Wix website, you'll typically need to adjust the DNS settings of your domain in your GoDaddy account to point to Wix email servers. Now, the first thing we need to do is from here... We need to navigate on your Wix um, sites dashboard and go to the settings or mailbox sections because you should find the MX, which means mail exchange records or mail server details provided by Wix. When you do that right here, now after getting that information, we need to log into our GoDaddy account. Now from the GoDaddy account, we need to find the domain name in the list of products or domains associated with your godaddy account right now click on the domain name to access its settings now i'm gonna be using this one click on manage and then now once we are here all we're gonna do is click on the domain and we need to access the uh, dns management or dns section click on the domain right here click on that now you see the manage uh, dns settings right here in the upper right corner obviously we need to click on it and once you've done that now from here we need to locate the existing mx mail exchange record in the uh, dns settings these records determine where email for your domain is routed if there are mx records like this one you may need to delete them or modify them to point to your wix server all right and of course we can add the new mx records by provided by wix now from here all we're gonna do is click on add new record and once we've done that what we need to do next is simply choose a type which is gonna be an mx obviously and then after that now you need to get all these values in your Wix website, such as name or email, priority and value. Okay. And once you've done that, all you're going to do is click on save. Okay. Click on it. Now here's an optional but recommended uh, thing that we could do to improve email deliverability and security. We need to add SEF record. Now click on it and choose a type file type, which is going to be an SPF or a sender policy framework right here. And a DKIM, which is a domain keys identified records. Because from here, you need to follow the Wix instructions for adding SPF and DKIM records. Now these records are usually added to text records in your DNS settings and after adding all of it save changes and that's a wrap for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you in the next one